Hello and welcome to this session. Today we are going to learn how to create test suite and test suite collection in Catalan Studio for our API testing. Now test suite is a collection of test cases and test suite collection as the name says it is a collection of test suites. Now in our Catalan Studio let me go to my Catalan Studio and uh, this is the project that we have been creating in our earlier sessions. So if you see when we run our test cases uh, We do get the logs, but we do not get any result getting generated and there is a reports folder here If you look at this reports folder, this is empty. So in Catalan studio Reports gets generated only for test suite or test suite collection So I will go to the test suite here and you can do a right click and say new and say test suite and give it any name I will say this is test suite 1 and say ok and here I can just click on this add button and add all the test cases or any test cases I want so this will display all the test cases you have added and you can select the test cases and say ok and once you select you still get a column here for run where you can check or uncheck the test cases that you want to run or not run so if I will uncheck this I just want to run let us say test one it will just run this or this will run both the test cases and here now you can uh, just say here run so this will run our test suite which has these two test cases and let us just wait for this run to get over so this is running fine until now and yes so this is done and yes this is done so here now if you go to the reports and you can see this is the report folder and it has a report here and you can click here it will show you the report so here it will show you the overall status of these two test cases and then here you can see the summary the execution settings and the execution environment and here if you click on this you can see the test case logs and whatever test you click on it will show you that logs for that particular test case here so you can click on any of the test cases and you can get the logs here and then you can also go to this report containing folder so you can say open containing folder and here you can get the HTML of your report so you can see this is a report HTML I will click here and you can open it in any of the browsers and you can see the report here so in case of any failure it will give you the uh, detailed uh, reasons and stack trace in my case it is everything is passed so you can see the report is here so this is how you can create test suite and of course test suite collection is similar so again go to test suites and say test suite collection and I will say this is test suite collection one and say ok and here we can add the test suite so as of now we have a single test suite I will add it here now here you can see the advantages you can select the profile so I can either uh, create multiple test suites and uh, select different profiles or I can also add the same test suite again and I once want to run it with a default profile and then I want to run it with a QA profile as well so you can see it is once running with QA profile and once running with the default profile and you can also select sequential or parallel so if you want to run your test suites in parallel you can select this and say execute and this will now execute our tests or test suites so you can see this is running our test suite collection which has our test suite one added two times one with a default profile and second time with the QA profile so it will run it two times with both of these profiles and once this is done we will look at the output so this is running fine until now and yes everything looks okay and here you can see it has also generated the report and you can see there are two reports getting generated for both of these so you can see there are two reports this is the report with two different profiles and you can similarly check the report like we have used for test suite so the report that gets generated is for every test suite 
and also you can see the HTML by going to the containing folder. So this is how you can create test suite and test suite collection and also create reports in Catalon Studio for our API testing project. I hope this session was very useful for you. Thank you for watching.